In this video, I will be showing you how to connect your digital piano keyboard like this Yamaha P125 to your MacBook. If you want to play garage band, uh, main stage, or virtual instruments like Contact app, uh, I will show you how to connect your digital piano to the computer and how to set it for live performance. First, you will need this uh, printer cable. It is just an uh, ordinary printer cable, USB cable, and we will connect it at the back of your uh, digital piano. Connect it to the USB to host. There, this one here. Then connect this to your MacBook. Look at the owner's manual of your keyboard and turn off the local control. So first, there's a piano sound. We must turn off the onboard sound of this keyboard. Okay, by pressing the function. And then the local control is located here. Okay. There's no piano sound anymore. First, let's set up this one on Logic Pro for your recording. New. Okay, new software instrument. So, we'll choose the piano sound. Uh, Yamaha Grand Piano, I think. And then, so, go to Preference. And there's an audio. And you need to set this one if it is built-in output it is the uh, of your computers uh, built-in headphones you must set it to digital piano so your sound of your MacBook will stream direct to the digital piano of your Yamaha P125 it has an built-in audio interface so then let's try it here first let's try the sound of the piano so it will sound direct to the onboard speaker and you're good to record. Okay, let's try to play it. Okay, next, let's set up this one. Okay, in GarageBand, let's try in GarageBand. Okay, in GarageBand, you just go to Preference, set it also to... Here it has a digital piano. You just put it on your digital piano so the sound of your uh, MacBook will stream direct to the onboard speaker of your um, P125. You just uh, click the output to digital piano. Now let's set up this one on your uh, contact, contact virtual instruments. So this is your contact app. So I think uh, we'll try to use this piano grandeur for the example. So and then go to the set settings. The settings is here. Okay, there's a settings here. This one here. You click that settings. So the MIDI should be on. The digital piano, then the audio should be here. There's a device, there's a built in speaker, it should be on the di digital piano. Okay, the output should be here's an audio here. Click the digital piano. So the output of this uh, virtual instrument will play on your Yamaha P125. Okay, close. Okay, now it sounds. This is the sounds of your... This is your virtual instrument now. So, we can test this one. With different kind of type of sounds. J. 
jazz. Okay, that is how you uh, navigate this one. If also if it's not functioning, you can choose also this item here, this a lit little circle here. It is your MIDI output. So your MIDI should be on Omni or in the port A. Omni or in the port A. Port A. Okay. That's that is the how you connect this one. Next, let's try to set up this one on main stage for live performance. Let's use Okay, let's let's wait for the app to open. And then go to this one main stage again. Up here, this one main stage here, the settings, preference, and then the output should be on the digital piano. If you are if you have an external amplifier, you can put built-in output or you just if you don't have a uh, built-in if you don't have external amplifier you will be using the digital piano you choose the digital piano output so that's it and then let's try okay it's functioning now okay let's try is how simple you set up this one if you have any questions and suggestions for my next video just comment down below and if you like digital piano tutorial tricks and tips on how to sound uh, better on your piano uh, consider following the channel and bye for now thank you